My name is Sedna, a dwarf planet candidate. I'm in the furthest reaches of our solar system in orbit. On November 14th in 2003, the Palomar Observatory is who discovered me. The names of astronomers are Michael Brown, Chad Trujillo, and Dave Rabinowitz are how I was found. My name Sedna means Inuit goddess of the sea, which derived from a young arctic woman's grim Eskimo story. I'm a large minor planet, that is what I will be, until I meet the criteria for dwarf status, you see. My name is Sedna, a dwarf planet candidate, I'm in the furthest reaches of our solar system in orbit. My distance from the sun in my furthest orbit is about 84 billion miles, I barely see it. If you saw the sun from that distance, you wouldn't squint. It would be so small, it could be blocked with the head of a pin. I'm the second reddest object in our solar system. The first reddest is Mars, yeah, I am second to him. I am three-fourths the size of our dwarf planet Pluto, and I'm believed to live in the inner or cloud, you know. My name is Sedna, a dwarf planet candidate. I'm in the furthest reaches of our solar system in orbit. The time I'm about to take to orbit our sun once is 10,500 Earth years. Yeah, that is a long run. It's predicted the last time I was closest to our sun. Earth was coming out of its last ice age. Now that isn't fun. I live in the coldest snow region of our solar system. It's minus 240 degrees Celsius where I'm from. My name is Sedna, a dwarf planet candidate. I'm in the furthest reaches of our solar system in orbit. My name is Sedna, a dwarf planet candidate. I'm in the furthest reaches of our solar system in orbit.